Well, today, hey Jay, we are not in Tennessee. We're in Mentone, Indiana, up here at Outlaw Smokers. Reason being, he's built this new pit we want to show off. Also, I want to show you why I always film on a tripod because this here looks kind of like I was riding a kangaroo in a bouncy house. But in the end, it was worth it just to show you this nice, shiny, pretty pit right before we put it through the ringer and get it dirty. Now, for my cook here, we're going to do ribs. I'm not going to give you much of a recipe because this is about the smoker, but I do want to show you I put rub on this rack of ribs with no mustard, and it stuck to it. That's amazing. I didn't know that could be done. All right, get a rub down. Let's rub down a few more racks. Here's the herby blend we're working on. Maybe a rack with salt, pepper, and garlic. You got to give it that snort test because if it doesn't snort good, you probably won't eat good. And this is a great opportunity to introduce you to the game. We got Jay Craig, pit builder herself. Son Alec, Ryan, son of Butcher, and one and only Mark Williams, Wine Life Barbecue. They know what's up. And since we're doing a rib cook, might as well throw some beef ribs on there already. Now back to the star of the show. Here is Hoss. Hoss is a masterpiece. Beautiful work of art. We're going to start down here on the firebox end. We open it up. You can see we have one heck stick burner firebox. Except there's some baskets on the bottom. Check them what they're for. My earliest memories of barbecue was my dad and my grandpa burning coals, shoveling on a cinder block pit. The only reason I remember that is because I had a brand new pair of boots, and I decided to stomp around in them coals. We're in a good pair of boots. I wonder if I got a whooping. Well, that's the day when youngins was raised up bright, so I probably did. But anywho, well, when I got older and got to cook my own hog, I can remember shoveling coals and getting that awesome flavor that you get from that meat dripping down on them coals. It's just something you'll never forget. That's recreated that box right there. But also, you have a stick burner. That stick burner is going to give you a texture that only a stick burner can. But we've got heat coming over the top. We got heat coming from the bottom. We just got cooking awesomeness. This thing run 275 like a dream. With it snowing all day, 175 mile per hour winds. Top that mark. Now on this end, we're going to pull out this rack, and we're going to pull out the rack on top of that rack. The reason being, this is a hog cooker. If you go check out Fine Life Barbecue's video, you can watch how we cooked that hog the day before. We're going to load this thing up with ribs. Okay, not really. I couldn't afford all the ribs it would take to fill this up we're gonna put a few ribs on there just see how it works will it cook them even will we get that flavor just have to see brian pushes this back in i'm gonna get her up oh, tripped over my own tripod hmm maybe i'm not as much of a filmographer as i thought i was anyway oh i forgot we've got a whole nother end down here by the firebox need something in it so for a snack we're just gonna throw on a Couple wings. You know, we got about a four and a half hour cook on these ribs. So we got to eat something. That's pretty much it for that pit. Let me tell you, it is awesome. Now, this is here. If you want to look real close, I'm, I'm always working on different recipes. And so we filmed it just in case these ribs were good. I remember what I did. Well, I showed you, so they must have been great. Look at the color on all them ribs. That's two hours in. Salt and pepper. Ooh, that's real nice. Snort it up very fine get them wrapped up and uh that's pretty much it for the video let me tell you these ribs was fine it had that flavor of the shoveling coal it had the texture that stick burn this is the best of both worlds barbecue pit there you have it mighty fine looking real that's it thank you for watching I appreciate you. Mojo is out. <laughs>